Today we're checking out the most expensive keyboard that I had on the channel and you guys know me I normally try to stay under $100 or around $100 to recommend the most all-around keyboard that anybody can use for gaming, for media, for office and anything else but now I stepped out out of my comfort zone and bought this $220 keyboard to show it to you guys. What's going on guys welcome back to How I Says channel my name is Ivan and today we're looking at the Lofri Edge very high quality and very expensive keyboard and what I'm saying expensive is this one is $220 of course when you add taxes and all that stuff it gets to around $230 so this is probably the most expensive keyboard I personally have seen and had a pleasure to review but also is the most expensive one that I bought on this channel the biggest elephant in the room here is the price we're gonna talk about this in the conclusion and for the money of a $220 I can tell you right now you can probably get two three other very good keyboards that I've reviewed in the past that is going to do the same job but before that we're going to jump straight into the unboxing see what exactly is in this very high quality box see what kind of accessories Lofri are offering for that kind of price we're going to look at the features we're going to plug it in we're going to see the backlight and everything else and of course at the end we're going to talk about it in the conclusion so we're going to see what's inside the Lofri Edge but before just admire how luxury this uh, box is honestly I don't see boxes like that very often uh, but you can see even a little graphic of the keyboard inside right here kind of embossed this is super shiny uh, paper that's going over the luxurious box uh, on the back there's some information about the keyboard you, you can see 2000 milliamp hour uh, battery inside all that information is right here what the keycaps are alloy body all that stuff some information about the company our genuine stickers and everything so after you slide that out and move it classy black matte box even the camera has a hard time focusing on it and once you open it even the lid is padded here we have foam and right on top we have warranty cards and user manual of course we have in english as well this is very well organized package there's a little uh, envelope as well and here is the keyboard off to the side we have another little box we're gonna go ahead and open this one first see what's inside so right here is the cable let's see what the cable looks like this is again a very high quality cable can't stress that enough rarely I see cables like that the braiding is fabric of something that I haven't seen it kind of reminds me of snake pattern uh, the tips are very solid uh, ABS plastic with some gold plated tips a right angle here or 90 degrees angle plug USB-C obviously with uh, the company name and these this cable is five feet long so not too long but at the same time very high quality and fairly soft by the way you can stick with this cable you know how adamant about softness of the cable i am so this one is definitely approved by me i love this cable and in this little pouch let's see what else is inside very interesting so first we have two little rubber standoffs or legs these are branded with a company logo and then we have six different keys that you can replace three of them are kind of different shade of orange super dark orange almost red natural orange and this is light orange almost yellow these are the colors of the company and one of the most attractive things to me if you haven't noticed i absolutely love orange and black combinations and here these other three keys have kind of a alien insignia on them with the same darker to regular to very light orange in the middle of them very nice touch here by the company so love when they provide keys like that that you can replace and spice up other things a little bit and we have another surprise right at the bottom right here this is actual carbon fiber elements you can have all these four piece them together and construct a small kind of a stand-up display that you can prop your keyboard or displays or screens or tablets but this is an actual carbon fiber this is not plastic this is not abs this is not metal this is actual carbon fiber that's why the price of this keyboard is so high we're going to piece this together uh, in a little bit uh, but all the four elements are right here on the bottom and you have a little pull tab to kind of take them off the uh, foam and here out the back is the instructions how to piece everything together step one step two step three step four oh actually these rubber pieces 
right here these rubber pieces are going inside to keep that uh, display together to hold it together a very uh, nice instruction large here is the keyboard in their own packaging with the name again and once we take it out of the packaging here it is super classic super classy black surrounded by actual carbon fiber abs plastic keys and all the other side of the whole keyboard is aluminum so aluminum for those outside of the united states aluminum for the people here some ventilation here and if kind of peek through i don't know if the camera will pick it up but kind of if you peek through these holes you can see the lofri large letters displayed in the bottom for the company name interesting touch they went out of the way to create a very high-end very expensive very compelling product here branding on the bottom with some more information here about the battery and everything else rubber feet very slim in the front sticky uh, rubber feet in the back very sticky as well and you can prop it up with the rubber as well so it gives you a little bit more height on the right side we have the company logo right here written in on the left side we have nothing and on the top right in the middle is the USB-C where you're gonna plug the keyboard. And of course here is the little switch, metal switch again. You can turn it off or go to the Bluetooth option, which this keyboard supports. So options here we have is off, on, or Bluetooth. We don't have wireless, only wired and Bluetooth. But once I turn it to Bluetooth, you will see the backlight. Now it's coming out. The backlight is only wide backlight, no RGB here. Keeping it again, very classy, very classic. You see the blinking light here for the connection to the Bluetooth. So nothing crazy when it comes to RGB. But you will see the writing on top of the keys is unusual and different. Different fonts, completely different to normal gaming keyboards and stuff like that. So this one is uh, something special. Very, very light considering the, the, the whole thing is made of carbon fiber and aluminum this keyboard is very light super sturdy no bending whatsoever obviously don't go knocking it or sitting on it but this one is really high quality i'm telling you obviously the price over 200 dollars is a lot for a keyboard for any kind of peripheral but that's why i wanted to step out of my normal price range under a hundred dollars check out something that's priced higher more high-end and see what they're offering and this product is kind of a, you know, Halo product, a kind of a top of the line product, kind of a Apple like product. I guess I can say because of the materials used, the attention to details, the craftsmanship and everything else. You see how the carbon fiber here, it's connected to the aluminum base with these screws, kind of like uh, what they're using on laptops. Uh, obviously the keys are low profile here. We're not having the full height uh, keys but being mechanic this is what you can expect uh, from the sound to me they sound very silent uh, probably more silent than the red keys i love how this sound and you will notice that immediately this keyboard has one extra roll on top dedicated functional uh, key roll uh, a lot of these small compact ones are omitting this and giving you kind of combination but here you have it all together and some of the combinations here fn and f6 will increase the light and f5 will decrease the light you'll see you have different stages here media keys volume keys over here with the fn as well uh, microphone and all that stuff delete page up page down are dedicated on the side row so a lot of keys here once you get used to it it'll be great but again you can replace some of these keys let's say w s a and d with the colored ones they give you or maybe you want to replace the uh any of the other ones here with the orange make it a little bit more visible like escape put the orange right here whatever you want to do that's uh that's a good customizations they give you as well what i'm seeing right here with the keyboard and with the stand this is indeed a very high quality product let's put this together real quick and see how it works so if I pull all the elements out, we can follow the instructions. Uh, first and foremost, we have the side panels, which we're gonna be sticking to this one right here, like so. Once this is together, we can put the bottom. So there is very easily everything comes together. And if I take uh, one of the rubber pieces that are providing, we are going to plug those right here on both sides to kind of keep everything together with a company logo. And there we are. We got the stand. So imagine if you have 
a tablet or even the keyboard. I can just place it right here and it was just going to stay like that. And you can place something else on the other side, the opposite side, and you can kind of see what the keyboard looks like with the stand or the display. Rubber is extremely sticky, by the way, it goes straight to my desk and doesn't move at all. I can definitely get used to this keyboard. And obviously, if you're on the road somewhere lighter, it's better. Throw it in your backpack and off you go, connect it to your computer through the Bluetooth or wired, of course, if you want to use the cable and you're going to be great. So yeah, that's pretty much it with the unboxing overview with this one. We're going to jump into the conclusion and talk about the benefits and the negatives of the Lofree Edge. All right, final words on the Lofree Edge. Well, I have to say this is the highest quality keyboard I have personally seen and I personally have right here in my house that I've tested. And the materials obviously are high quality and expensive. We have aluminum and real carbon fiber. Those cost a lot of money. So the asking price is not really unreasonable, but is it really worth spending this kind of money to get you a keyboard that has only Bluetooth and wired where you can get for less than $100, very high quality keyboard that provides wireless, wired and Bluetooth. So you're gonna have to make that decision for yourself. What really fits into your budget? what really you are looking for when buying a keyboard. To me, this is a very high end, very high level Halo product in par with some very well known brands that are trying to sell a very high quality uh, products that a lot of people actually absolutely love. Personally to me, I would not recommend this keyboard for $220 for the reasons I mentioned before. Outside of that reasoning, this keyboard is absolutely astonishing. Very slim, low profile, very light, high-end materials, high quality everything, extra caps, great cable, and even the box is super high quality. I mean, they spent a lot of time designing this product. They spend a lot of time engineering and thinking how to create a very compelling product. And as a product itself, it is excellent. I have no complaints of the keys. I have no complaints of the build quality, light. Like I mentioned, you can throw this in your backpack and travel and save some on the weight. You can add something else to your bag, for example, but I would not recommend this instead of another gaming keyboard that maybe one of those that I showed you uh, recently with the LCD screens. I find those a little bit more exciting uh, than something that it's using just a high quality materials. But outside of that, this keyboard is incredible. I mean, if the keyboard was at the same price, around $100 like the other ones, I'll take this one every day just because how high quality this keyboard is. Hopefully the camera picks it up, but I mentioned it at the beginning, the even the company name can be seen through the perforations on the bottom, Lofree, uh, kind of a large letters. So yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Hit the thumbs up if you like the video, stay tuned to the channel, subscribe if you're new. Uh, check out the other videos coming very, very soon. I have tons of other products to show you before the holiday season so you can make an educated uh, purchase for your future builds, your computers and stuff like that. Um, check out the link in the description below if you want to support the channel directly. It helps me tremendously to bring you products like this and show it to you guys. And as always, you have a wonderful day.